Vuitton, guys? Well, guys, we thank you so much for coming to our Swing for the Cure concert. Um, the first concert Ethan and I have ever organized. Um, and we are so excited to perform for you guys. Uh, we've been working basically since the beginning of the school year to get all these tunes down. And uh, we'll be starting with our pocket crew ensemble. Um, let's introduce some of the players. We have on tenor saxophone, Luke Little. <laughs> Trevor Atchett.
effect. Or some serious
Can everyone hear me okay? Yeah. I don't know. I'm not gonna... yeah. um, I just want to say to all the middle school AOMS jazz students, um, and you guys know where to go. You guys will come out over here to Miss T with her arms waving. Go follow her. Um, and I mean, these guys close it out for a few That's years. right. Thank um, you. <laughs>
know, just kind of speech about our project and, and what this project means to us and what Jack means to us and what all this money that we are collecting, like all that cause, we're gonna explain that right now. <laughs> um, I just wanna say, as of now, we are a thousand dollars over our goal. So So we we had like our expectations are just blown up. Um, Thank you guys so much. Yeah, no, it's it's really something. So um, I just want to start. Uh, just want to talk about kind of um, the type one diabetes and and where and where it is right now. Um, currently, I mean, of course, as as you guys know, my friend Andrew and I are both type one diabetics. Um, and we are throwing this concert, obviously, as a benefit to Type 1 Diabetes Research through JDRF. Um, JDRF is the number one uh, leading organization in the world for, um, you know, just Type 1 Diabetes support, care, and, and, and support and finding a cure. So every, like, every dollar, every cent is just a one step closer to finding a cure, and it's something that, like, I mean, I know that Andrew and I dreamed about. <laughs> um, and it's just, Something that means a lot to us, and, and it's and it's really an emotional topic for us, just because of of how type one diabetes affects you as a person. And I think so many other people. I mean, plenty of you guys probably know someone uh, with type one diabetes, or and how you know just their daily life and how it's so much different, and and how they you know treat themselves and the technology that's out there is truly amazing. Um, we. Andy and I really have not too much to complain about just because of how far they've gotten with technology. Um, yeah, no, round of applause. Yeah. So all this money is, is going straight to that, and I just thank you guys so much for just, just, I don't know, just, you know, having that effort to pull out your phone and scan that QR code and just put a little $5 in there, or like, or like, I don't know, some people some people are doing sixties and eighties and it's just it's so encouraging to see. It's so encouraging yeah, to see. So awesome. um just wrapping it up, uh maybe bringing it back to kind of the little, little history of our group here that we're about to have up. If they wanna come out now, you guys you guys wanna come out now. <laughs>
uh, I think we have what four numbers. Four numbers. Four numbers. Uh, we'll keep it. We don't want to keep you guys too long, but you know, we'll see what the music wants. And then just one more thing. Um, I really want to thank my dad. He's a fantastic graphic design artist. Um, just a side hobby, and somehow managed to make it so awesome for us. Um, it really just spikes up the game for this
Thank you guys so much, and I, I hope to see you in the part two. Yeah. <laughs> 